Hi! Today we are going to be talking about fewer and more. We're going to be comparing numbers and we're going to use pictures to help us do that. So our first question says, which group has fewer boxes? Fewer, that's an important word, I'm going to circle it. Fewer means less or lower. So let's look at our groups of boxes. You might be able to look and see which one has less, but I still like to count to be sure. So let's count, count with me. First group, one, two, three, four, five, six. So this group has six boxes. Let's check the next one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This has ten. You might ask yourself, why am I crossing out the boxes as I count them? This allows me to make sure that I don't skip any boxes from being counted and I don't count any boxes twice. It's a good way to check yourself as you're going. So which group has fewer boxes? Which is less, six or ten? Six is less, so that means Six boxes is fewer. Let's do another one. Which group has fewer bananas? You should be able to look at this right away and say, oh my gosh, which one is less? This group has four, this group has one. Which has fewer? One it is, one is low. Which group has fewer sports cars? And I'm gonna circle fewer because what does fewer mean? Lower. All right, let's count our first group. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six. Next group, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so we have six and nine, which is fewer or lower. Six is. Good job. Let's do another one. Which group has fewer ants? I'm gonna circle that fewer again to help us out. It's, I circle it to make it stick out. Okay, how many ants do we have on this side? Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six. How about on the other side? One, two, three. Which is fewer, six or three? Three is fewer, so our answer is on the right. Let's do another one. Which group has fewer sports cars? So again, I'm gonna circle fewer, so it's a keyword I'm looking for. All right, let's count the first group. You count out loud as I cross them out. How many did you get? Eight, good. All right, I'll cross out as you count out loud. Go ahead. Five, nice job. So which is fewer, eight or five? Five is fewer, nice job. Next, which group has more bananas? Uh-oh, I don't see fewer, I see more. So we don't want the lower number, we want the higher number this time. So which group has more bananas? They look kind of close, and this is one of those times where it's important to count and check. All right, count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six in this group. Let's check this other group. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Whoa, really close. We have six and seven, but which is more? Is six more or is seven more? Seven is more. Good job. Next, which group has more hats? Now I can look at it right away and tell which group has more. 
definitely this first group. The other group only has two. Next one, which group has more presents? They do look close, so I want to count this time to be sure. All right, I'm going to cross off. Remember, we're going for more, but let's cross off as we count. You count out loud as I cross off. Go ahead. Five, nice job. Okay, other side, count out loud. Seven, good job. So which is more, five or seven? Seven is more, way to go. All right, next one, which group has more oranges? Keyword, more, so we're going higher. Can you look at the pictures and tell which one right away has more? Good job, it's that first group. All right, let's try one more. Which group has more grapes? I think for this last one, it's a safe idea to count each group to be sure. Okay, so I will cross off as you count out loud. Go ahead. How many grapes did you get on that side? Seven, good job. All right, let's do the other side. Keep counting. How many did you get? 10. Okay, so which is more, seven or 10? 10? 10 is more. Great job, you did awesome this time. See you next time.